Welcome to Learn with Mish. Today, I'm going to teach you some practice of conversation that you would want to learn and this will also help enhance your vocabulary. This episode, same as the first practice conversation, I'll be giving you two listening uh, portions and then two uh, conversation portions wherein you can follow because there are words that you can follow. And then the last one would be the breaking down of the terms and the meaning. So let's get to it. Lesson for today, practice conversation number two. Ma, go at edit to iPad bo. Go at edit. Yeah, yeah, gua bo shame tang chong sha. Di kan wa shu di e pang. Gua shu diao, gua e tsue di te to bo. Shu diao, gua zha shu kwa mai. Shu pang diao, gua ku tak po a diam jing. Tak diao e tsue di te to be. E tsue di lo. Ma, gua e tsue di te to ipad bo. Bo e tsue di. Ya ya gua bo shame tang chong sha Di kan wa shu di e pang Gua shu diao gua e tsue di te to bo Shu diao gua zha shu kwa mai Shu pang diao gua ku tak po a diam jing Tak diao e tsue di te to be E tsue di lo Ma gua e tsue di te to ipad bo Bo e tsue di Ya ya gua bo shame tang chong sha Di kan wa shu di e pang Gua shu diao gua e tsue di te to bo Shu diao gua zha shu kwa mai Shu pang diao gua ku tak po a diam jing Tak diao e tsue di te to be E tsue di lo Ma gua e tsue di te to ipad bo Bo e tsue di Ya ya gua bo shame tang chong sha Di kan wa shu di e pang Gua shu diao gua e tsue di te to bo Shu diao gua zha shu kwa mai Shu pang diao gua ku tak po a diam jing Tak diao e tsue di te to be E tsue di lo Now let's break down the sentences Ma Gua e tsue di te to iPad bo? Mom, can I play iPad? E tsue di is can. Te to is play. Bo e tsue di. Bo e tsue is cannot or cannot play. Ya, ya, gua bo shami tang chong sha. Ya is boring. Ya, ya is very boring. Gua bo shami tang chong sha. I have nothing. Bo shami is nothing. Tang chong is to do. Xia is the shortcut of shami, which is in the previous episode is uh, means what, but in this case it's uh, it means something. So there's nothing to do. Next, di kang gua shu di e pang. It means you can organize or clean your room. Pang is room. Shu is organize. A simpler way to make the sentence is Di shu di e pang. Next, Gua shu diao, Gua e tsue di ti to ba? After I finish organizing, can I play? Gua shu diao is after I finish. Gua is I, e tsue di ken, ti to ba, can I play? This can also be asked as, Gua shu diao, gua e tsue di ti to bo. The ba here is used in a Philippine setting. Next line. Shu diao, gua zha shiun kwa mai. Shu diao, gua zha shiun kwa mai. After finish organizing, I will think about it. Shiu, shiu. Notice the nasal sound. Shiu means think. 
point is look. In this case, look into it or think about it if I will allow my son to play iPad. Okay, for the last slide. The son said, Shu pang diao, wako tak pwa tiam ting, tak diao e tuedit tito be. Which means, Shu pang diao, after organizing, wako tak. Gua is ay, kutak is additional, extra, extra reading time. Pwa tiam ting is pwa, pwa is half. Tiam ting is an hour. Half an hour, which means 30 minutes of extra reading. After doing all of that, can I play? So, in a sentence, after organizing, I will read 30 minutes extra. And then after reading, can I play? So, the mom replied, Etso edit lo. Which means, yes, you can play or you are allowed to play. The law here means already. Now you have learned the typical conversation between a mother and a son. And there are certainly plenty of conversations around the house. So in the future, I'll be doing some more of these practice conversations so that you can hear how words are used, how sentences are made, and how fast a conversation is. So that's it. Keep on learning. Bye!